Hey guys, today I'm doing albondigas for my neighbor. She's feeling sick under the weather. So you're gonna need a pound of ground beef, two potatoes, a cup of carrots, uh, half an onion, and we're gonna have one third of rice and water. And that's gonna go in your meatballs. You just let it Stay there for a while while you do your meat. You're gonna season your meat with my favorite seasoning. It's beef with tomato. Beef flavor. Here we go. One egg, right in there. We're gonna need to mix that with your hands. These are called albondigas. These are so good. We're gonna need one of these little boxes of tomato sauce. some water and put it to boil but first we're gonna do a meatballs and we're gonna like to fry them a little in a pan with a little I mean, not even oil the meat will let the oils come out from the meat gonna need some bread crumbs or cracker crumbs I do crackers then we're gonna chop these up and then put everything in the pot we're gonna put a little bit of garlic salt in it I always do the palm of my hand guys and I just drop it in a little bit of pepper just one two three there you go and some all of it yeah saltine cracker crumbs she just made them like a half a cup or less about half of the stack oh half of the stack and half of the packet that you the packet okay then we're gonna Throw that water away and keep the rice, just like that. And we're gonna put the rice in here. meatballs in it. Gonna add a little bit of oil to your pan, just a tiny bit. For my veggies. another pan. Let's move our meatballs to that big pan. I'm gonna put some sauce in it. All right guys, we're gonna put two cups of water in our blender. I'm gonna put one tablespoon of onion. I'm gonna put one tomato and one of these um, tomato sauce cans is 7.4 ounces a little bit of tablespoon actually that's what we're right to our meatballs we're gonna put saute carrots potato all in there that's how it looks Put our tomato sauce in there. Now we're 
gonna cover it up and let that simmer. Boiled actually. I added one more cup of water because I wanted to cover the meatballs with the potatoes and the carrots. I'm gonna put this to medium and I'm gonna leave it for 30 minutes. Okay guys, in this pan we're gonna put two cups of rice. One, two, we're gonna stir our rice so it doesn't burn. For two cups of rice, it's four cups of water. For those four cups of water, I'm gonna put two tablespoons of my favorite oil flavor. I'm gonna stir that. My rice is cooking, four cups of water. from seven to medium. We're gonna put our lid on. Our rice is done. Our meatballs are done. 